So we're here backstage at Live the Docklands and I'm joined by Josh Gray. Josh, how are you getting on? I'm not too bad, how are you? Good, I know we grabbed you now fresh off the stage. How is it playing out there in Limerick? Yeah, it's still buzzing. It's mad to play in a tent that big and obviously supporting the Coronas as well. Like, as you just kind of hit me on stage as well. It's like this time two years ago, I was at the Clemaine gig. I was like, I'd love to play at something like this one day. And two years later, I'm supporting the Coronas. Here you are. So, like, <laughs> it's amazing. Because, like, fair play to the Dolans now. Like, when they first said about Live the Docklands, I know we were all so excited. And then, as you said, the first day I went into the tent, I just looked up and I was like, oh, my God, it's so big. Like, it's oh, such it's an amazing it's venue. I couldn't believe it. Like, and it's just playing, playing, like, in a venue that size as well. And then you just kind of hear, ah, it's and you see that many people there. It's madness. Yeah, it's it is. Madness. It is so, so cool. Now, I know I can't keep you for too long because you're on the road again. Tell me what's road. going on. Uh, yeah, we're, we're heading up to KFS now. I'm on stage at midnight, so we're literally down here then up again so it's good crack though be honest tell uh, me how busy is your right. summer very to be honest <laughs> yeah i think we're on c sessions next kaleidoscope independence um a couple more then as well i think there's like picnic my last stuff and then another couple of gigs my own show in london uh my headline show in the academy so yeah we're kind of just busy 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 so. now i'll have to ask what does josh do to chill out like is there a, like a video games is there sport what is your thing that you do away from music I, don't, I just don't chill out like <laughs> I literally don't I can't sit still I'm sitting on the phone I'm still probably working I'm sending an email or like I'm just tidying up things I have to do or I'm just playing the guitar on the couch I'd have a TV but don't watch it like, oh you're like me I have it there and I'm like I just gather and dust gather, gather and dust like literally so that's the thing I think I've like I just can't sit still and what about the, the football that's gone the weekend Liverpool Spurs oh, yeah, did you catch yeah, any of that fair, to be fair like being a Liverpool fan so oh, uh, yeah, oh. yeah 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 Keen the so, cameraman's a Spurs fan. If we can see this, I don't know. But uh, <laughs> so yeah, I stayed up like last night obviously to watch the match. Didn't go have a drink or anything like that because obviously being professional gigging today and tonight and then stuff. So I was over the moon to just sit there with a with a burger chips and just watch the match. So I have to did. say the the uh, no star in Limerick City it was just like there was Liverpool jerseys and the odd Tottenham Hotspurs. Now I don't know if I should say this or not, but I was spotted in a Spurs jersey. Ah no, interview is over. I'm, oh, yes. I'm actually, actually a Man United fan. Oh, that's fair enough. Well, that's actually worse. Uh, uh, no offence to any United fans listening, but uh, six, six. <laughs> um, yeah, so pretty much that was probably the first time we probably got to actually sat th- sit down and watch a match all season. I was a Champions League final, so it wasn't a bad one to sit yeah. down and watch, you know. But uh, yeah, just kind of super busy um, over the summer, of course, back and forth to London as well. Um, just kind of wrapping up the EP or albums, kind of undecided as to which it's going to be yet. So, the kind of I don't know, probably leaning t- leaning towards more so an album that this was supposed at this stage, just the amount of songs we have, you know. So, um, just really enjoying it, like this to say the least. And tell me again, what date is the London gig? Uh, London gig is the 3rd July in Hot Fox and then my headline show is in the Academy in Dublin on the 20th of September oh absolutely amazing and I have to say like I used to live in London and one thing that is when Irish acts come over the Irish turn up oh yeah there's definitely a party going like when there's an <laughs> Irish act like the Irish are out in force so no I'm really looking forward to it it's mad again like just doing a show over in London so I can't wait you know I kind of didn't expect it this early in my career either you know so it's uh, everything's just kind of been really quick happening really really quickly so I can't complain well, look, you deserve every moment of it, and we wish you all the very best. Have the best time in London and Killarney and in the Academy. And Josh, thank you so much for chatting to the Limerick Post. Yeah, cheers for having me.